everyone, I'm Po Ai from Simpang Ampat, Penang. So in 2017, in December, I had breast cancer, stage 3. So in 2018, January, I listened to the doctor's recommendation and had an operation. So the doctor told me that it's important to replenish on my body so that I can get ready for the chemotherapy. So during that time, I would eat a lot of uh, supplements, alkin supplements to condition my body. So actually, the first time when I went for chemotherapy, I was really dizzy and then I was really nauseous and had a loss of taste and I had no appetite at all. So in the morning, I would eat one cap full of spirulina and in the afternoon, another one cap full and at night, another one full cap full. So after three uh, weeks after my first chemo, I had to go for the second chemo session. So before that, I have to take a blood test to see if my red blood cells or white blood cells meets the requirement to undergo the second chemo session. So actually, I was really fortunate because I always meet the requirements, which didn't interfere with my chemo session. So I uh, finished six sessions of chemotherapy. And my hair had fallen down. But I was really positive I would try to keep condition my mindset. So after my chemotherapy session, in September, I had a CT scan to see if whether the cancer is still active in my body. And so after two weeks, my report was out. And my doctor told me again that my liver has another tumor, cancerous tumor. So actually, from breast cancer to liver tumor, liver cancer, it was already stage four. So that time I started crying because people would say that uh, stage four is like it's like the end like there's no no way to battle it but then the doctor said the doctor told me that you shouldn't be thinking about how many days you have left you should go and do the stuff you, that you haven't been able to do so actually my body condition is very healthy and actually it's really a big deal to have two major surgery in a year. So, um, but my body was really good. So I, my surgery t took place in October. And my first surgery was two hours long because it's actually a really big major operation. And the possibility for a bacterial infection is also really high. But then in three days, I was able to be discharged, discharged from the hospital. And so the doctor told me that, okay, my body needs to be in really healthy and good condition to undergo the chemotherapy again. And the same thing, I would consume a lot of Elkin supplements, Elkin spirulina. So in December, I have undergone 24 chemotherapy sessions. So just uh, early this year, I did a CT scan and all reports came out good and healthy. So I want to let everyone know. It doesn't mean that it's end of the world if you have cancer. Instead, it's not about, it's not about having, spending a lot of money, uh, going to the best hospital or getting the best doctor. But it, the most important thing is about your mindset and how you condition your body after the surgery. So, because the doctor told me that only a healthy body condition, only with that, you can battle the cancer. So, I'm not saying that the road of battling, the journey of battling the cancer is easy but it's possible it's because actually a lot of people during if they get cancer they would wait like they will lose a lot of weight but for me i actually I, so during my six chemotherapy session i actually went from 50 kg to 70 kg because 
The doctor told me that you have to eat, you have to gain weight, you have to keep your body healthy so that you can battle this cancer. So that you can have a healthy body condition. And so, I was able to overcome it. I hope that my sharing had helped everyone.